Hey guys, how's it going? This is Deadly. As some of you may know, I am participating in combat scrum discussions that take place bi-weekly with the developers, uh, with Brian Hicks, uh, and we mainly discuss combat. Myself, Smack, Respawn on Me, I Win You Lose, Minder and Break all come together and we discuss different methods of combat, uh, different bugs, suggestions on ways to make combat feel smoother in the game. Although I'm under an NDA and I can't talk about a lot of things that we discussed during the first combat scrum, I can discuss something that I hold very close to my heart, and that is improvised weapons. Uh, some of you guys may know who watch the live stream on a regular basis, I am in love with the idea of the improvised bow, and also I'm going to throw it in there, the crossbow, since I've had that pretty cool crossbow kill a couple days ago. Uh, I actually got the opportunity to ask Brian Hicks uh, what he thought about the bow and if they plan on making any changes to it because if anybody has tried to use the bow it is definitely not ideal and I understand it, the using the improvised bow shouldn't be ideal because it's an improvised weapon you're supposed to use it kind of like as your last chance but for people who do want to use the bow obviously the way it works right now is a little difficult but it works <laughs> I think that's something that he did mention. It works. It's not something that is really broken in the game. So anyways, this is his response um, on the status report on uh, September 15th uh, about the improvised bow. Obviously, the current method of using the improvised bow in combat is not ideal. It is functional, but we have a good ways to go with it until we're happy. Most of that is either A, going to be affected by upcoming changes to the animation system and player controller, or B, going to come in beta when our focus shifts from primarily feature development to bug fixing. In short, in the end, we most definitely want the bow combat to both be viable and rewarding. I'm also going to show you guys the model for the recurve hunting bow. Keep in mind, this is work in progress. This was released June 4th, 2015, uh, and it kind of shows the ideas of moving uh, from the improvised bow into something a little bit more practical, um, this hunting bow. Obviously, we haven't seen this in any experimental update yet, most likely because of the amount of work that's going to have to go in to actually get this into the hands of a player model. I'm not a weapon designer in video games, so I'm only assuming here that it would probably take a lot more work uh, to get some kind of projectile based weapon to work correctly in a video game. I'm hoping when beta comes around and the development team has some time to relook the improvised bow and the way bow combat works. We're going to be seeing the recurve hunting bow enter the game as a viable option for people who are looking for a little bit more of an interesting approach to daisy combat i think it's a very awesome idea uh, to make sure that people who want to go around with the hunting bow are rewarded with it now i understand hunting bow versus firearm firearm should win every single time for survival games like Daisy, bows are sort of meant for that weapon for the sneaky individuals, the people who wait and be patient until the opportunity strikes. Even with the improvised bow in the game right now, it is very difficult to actually make some magic happen when sneaking up behind an enemy player, drawing back your bow, waiting for the correct sway to actually happen, and then release the arrow, hoping that you actually release it at the proper time to make sure that it hits accurately. And not only that, hits in the proper place and gets a kill. So there's a lot of factors that currently go into the improvised bow, and that's why the crossbow trumps it. You know, if you want to use a projectile weapon, the crossbow is your weapon. Um, I, I love the improvised bow, but it's so hard to use. Um, that, you know, most of the time when I use it, I always die. I'm trying my best to get some more cool footage for you guys, because I know a lot of people liked my last improvised bow video. It is a challenge, though. Very difficult. So anyways, guys, what do you think about the improvised bow, the recurve bow, um, and what Hicks and the developers had to say about the bow combat? I'd like to hear what you guys have to say in the comment section below, and I'll see you guys in the next video.